The book has many stories which are light-hearted in tone, such as his fascination with safe cracking, studying various languages, participating with groups of people who share different interests such as biology or philosophy, and ventures into art and samba music. Other stories cover more serious material, including his work on the Manhattan Project, during which his first wife Arlene Greenbaum died of tuberculosis, and his critique of the science education system in Brazil. The section Monster Minds describes his slightly nervous presentation of his graduate work on the Wheeler Feynman absorber theory in front of Albert Einstein, Wolfgang Pauli, Henry Norris Russell, John von Neumann, and other major figures of the time. The anecdotes were edited from taped conversations that Feynman had with his close friend and drumming partner Ralph Layton. Its surprise success led to a sequel entitled What Do You Care What Other People Think, also taken from Layton's taped conversations. Surely You're Joking, Mr. Feynman. Became a national bestseller. The closing chapter, Cargo Cult Science, is adapted from the address that Feynman gave during the 1974 commencement exercises at the California Institute of Technology. The title derives from a woman's response at Princeton University when, after she asked the newly arrived Feynman if he wanted cream or lemon in his tea, he absent-mindedly requested both. <laughs>